Bingo. Well, that one is definitely going in the daily scoop. You've been caught red-handed, sunshine. Just one more to confirm. Bingo, that's what I mean. You know, I'm only joking. So, hello. My name is Old School Journalist Photographer Black and White 1950s Shaw. Sure. I know it's a hell of a mouthful. I bet my mother regrets giving me that name now. But anyway... It is lovely to meet you on this mighty fine photography day. So I hear you're looking for a certain photography job. You want to be out on the streets as a photojournalist, always getting that front page scoop. Well, you know, us here are the best of the best of the best. So, what skills are you going to bring to this very well-established newspaper business? You're going to bring photos. Well, obviously, that's why you're here. You want to be in the moment. You want to be, you know, dialing in your camera settings. You want, oh, they pop out of a bush there. Bang. You've got it, you know. You want to be the man on the street, waiting, ready, ready. I mean, we don't always take pictures of people. Oh, no, no, no. We have a whole wildlife and sports section. And, um, well, I have personally dabbled in a bit of both. But I think that getting that front page scoop is where I am most at my strongest. So, here at um, Shaw's Photo Journalist Society for Photos and Journalists, I know another long title... It clearly must run in the family somewhere. So, what kind of gear have you got? Because this is our default camera setup for this newspaper. As you can see, old school film. This is the Olympus ON2 system. Everything is manual. All the buttons, all the knobs, all the cogs must be well, well maintained. They must be looked after. Because, well, when you're out in the field and you see your photo opportunity and you wind the film on and you aim down the lens, you get it focused, you get a thing, and then... You hear no click at all. Well, that's not what you want. You want to hear. And then you wind that film on. Because you've got your shot. We hold a tight schedule here. If you would like to come and work with us, there is actually no dedicated time. We, we might want you up at two in the morning we might not you we might not want you until six in the evening if there is a gala event going on we need pictures of them coming in coming out all dressed up you know what i'm saying so there is no time hence this is why it requires the true skill of the photographer you must be sharp, you must be ready, you must be alert all the time. 
because if we call you and we say, we need you here at this time and this location, you've got to be there. You got that. Excellent. Well, you can do, you, you can do that. Well, well, what's that device you've got there? What is this mobile phone? What, what, what are you doing with this? You're setting alarms and reminders. Well, that's unique. Here in the 1950s, we don't know what this mobile phone malarkey is. And yes, I know I said I'm from the 1950s and this camera was made in 1975. Don't worry about that. Here at the Journalist, Shaw's Photojournalist Society for Photographers and Journalists, we sometimes do a little bit of time traveling, but uh, we keep it on the hush hush because, it, well, if another journalist firm knew we had discovered time travel, well, we would be in trouble. How do you think we're always there to take the picture? You know, how do you think any journalist is there ready to take the picture? Because we are always ready, waiting with our time machine to photograph. The perfect moment. Anyway, that's just a kind of brief rundown of what we do. Is this appealing to you? Do you like the sound of how our organisation works? Oh, what's that? You have a problem with some kind of privacy policy? No, no, no. Don't worry about that at all. When it comes to privacy, Journalists are very respectful. But uh, no, no, no worry about that. Maybe, maybe you want some test subjects. Maybe, actually, before we even hire you, I need to see what you've got. I need to see some examples of some of your work. So uh, have you got anything you can show me now? Oh, you do? Excellent, right. Well, hand them over, let me have a look. Oh, you've got an envelope with what appears to be some negatives in. Well... Let me have a look what you've got. Wow, my goodness. You were, you seemed quite shy and timid. However, what I can tell from these images, blimey, you know what you're doing. You really do. Look at that. Blimey, it's almost as good as a picture I'd take, but not quite there, obviously, with, with more training and experience. You can achieve my level of journalistic photography, but for now, I've got to say, well, I'm just going to, uh, you know, that, that, that just disappeared, you know. I'm thinking tomorrow scoop for that one. Uh, you will be compensated. Obviously, since you don't work for us yet, you won't be credited. But let's just keep it on the down low for now. Well, well, well. Oh, look at that one as well. You've even got a hidden gem at the bottom of the pack here. Let me have a look at that under the light. Well, I'll be damned. That is quite the image. It may not well be, well, front page worthy, but I'm thinking second page. 
that uh, that's just mysteriously disappeared out of your pack. Well, I've got to say, these are looking excellent. If you would um, like to join the Shores Journalist Society for Photographer Journalists, and uh, I can't even remember my own company, but off the, that row of negatives, it's looking good. Wait, you have one more. Let me, let me have a look then. Well, oh my goodness gracious, good heavens. These are even better than the last ones. Why didn't you present me these first? These are much higher quality. Oh, and is that, is that black and white as well? I thought you only shot in colour. I mean, the 1950s world is only in black and white, but my goodness, these are some lovely, lovely photos, right, um, what did you say your name was again, excellent, excellent, let me just, uh, uh tuck them in there for now, right, um, well, I believe that's uh, your interview over. Uh, you know, usually for the record, you know, I've got to log an image of you for our database. So if you'd like to uh, sit back and smile. Yeah, let me just dial in a couple of settings. And hold still. Excellent. Excellent indeed. Now I'm just going to pop that back down there. And um, I believe we are done. Welcome to Shaw's Photography, Business, Journalism and Society for Photographers and Journalists. Um, you start immediately, so go out there into the world, get taking some photos, and I want them on my desk by Monday. I only want the best of the best, like your negatives, except I want them even better. Excellent. Right. See you Monday. Now get to it.